Hello, a chroi soi bawb sy'n ymuno ni yma o Eglwys Gymraeg, Canol Llundain, ar gyfer ein myfyrdod wythnosol ni. A warm welcome to everyone who's joining us uh, for this, our, our weekly meditation from the Welsh Church of Central London. And we begin, as usual, with a brief word of prayer and Gymraeg i ddechrau ac yn yn Saesneg, firstly in Welsh, followed by English. Felly, gawn i droi at yr arglwydd nawr mewn gweddi, cyd weddiw. Dyw a tha dain harglwydd iesu, dwi wn oedd flaen unwaith eto gyda chalonau diolchgar. Yn diolchgar am dygariad sy'n ein hamgylchynu, am holl fendithion ein bywyd ac am obaith ein ffydd yn iesu. God and Father of our Lord Jesus, we come before you once more with grateful hearts, grateful for your love which surrounds us, for all the blessings of our lives and for the hope of our faith in Jesus. Ar glwydd y cyfan clyw ein gweddi nawr yn ei enw ef, yn enw iesu. Amen. A rydym yn gweld iesu, we see Jesus. Dyna'r geiriau, welw ni yn, yn Hebreaid, yn yr ail bennod o lythyr Paul at yr Hebreaid, a nawfe dadnod. Na, mae'r rhan fwyaf o eglwysu a chapelu Cymru wedi dathlu gwyl ddewi yn barod yr wythnos wetha, siwr o fod. Ond gan ein bod ni nawr yn cyfarfod unwaith eto fe, fel eglwys am y tro cyntaf vers mis i o nawr, eh, dyma ni'n dathlu gyda'n gilydd heddiw, sef yr y, y sîl cyntaf ym mis mawrth. And one of St. David's great commissions or encouragements to us was to keep the faith and have a caduch of faith. And then Paul, and he looked here at her Hebraid, and gweld Jesse true faith, well, petai. Do we then honey, he would have he welded in a canawood, I guess. And then he welded true faith. So, the words of our, our text today don't, don't refer to anyone seeing Jesus in a worldly or human sense at all. Paul is speaking of faith. He's talking of a spiritual sight or a heavenly glimpse of Jesus, if you wish. Ac mae'r geiriau golwg a gweld yn cael eu defnyddio'n aml o fewn yr ysgrithirau Fel rhyw fath o metaffor neu ddelwedd neu symbol i egluro beth yw ffydd. Faith, the eye of the soul, as it's sometimes described. And as far as seeing with a human eye is concerned, I'd, I'd, I'd go as far as to say that it's the exact opposite of seeing with the eye of faith. I'm sure we've heard many people say, I wish I could have seen Jesus in the flesh, lived during his day and heard him speak and teach for myself. Well, yes, it, it must have been a great privilege to those, to those, of course, who are spiritually minded to see him in the flesh as well. But it was of no privilege whatsoever to those who are spiritually blind. Roedd llawer, mae ddylwch amdano fe, roedd llawer o'r bobl hynny oedd wedi gweld Iesu ac wedi clywed Iesu yn pregethu yn ei gyfnod ei hun, wel, ond nhw wedi i wrtho de, ond o nhw, ac wedi tanseilio a'i awdurdod a'i ddylanwad. Mae gweld Iesu gyda llygaid dynol, wel, ma, mae'n ddim byd o werth me, mewn gwirionedd, ond i bai ein bod yn gallu gweld e trwy lygaid ffydd hefyd. Therefore, I'd like to emphasize at the outset that Paul is, is speaking here of the spiritual eye rather than the human eye. Two considerations for you today as we meet, as it were, with the, with the eye of faith around the communion table this morning as we gather together as a church family once more. Firstly, the reason why faith is compared with sight. And secondly, to note 
that sometimes our faith, like our sight, is not always clear. We think going to have Pam, my fear, than Kalecham Harry, a Goluk. Dwi'n meddwl yn aml yn dyfe er i fod e'n peth o'r nadw i golli un o'ch synhwyrau. Mae colli eich golwg yn peth o'r nadw a'i thriadol yn dyfe. Sight is a, is a marvelously quick thing. How fast and far you can travel by sight. It doesn't take you an hour to make a journey from one part of the country to another with your eye. Rwy'n siŵr eich bod chi gyd wedi gweld y golwg feidd hyfryd mae o Lundain o, o lefydd tebyg i, I Primrose Hill a, a Parliament Hill, a Hampstead a, a Highgate ac, ac ar daloedd tebyg. Your eye can span the distance in an instant. Even, even the stars and the planets, when we look at them, we can't, we can't begin to imagine how far off they are. Yet your eyes can travel to them in a second on a clear evening to see the stars. Ac mae ffydd yn debyg i hynny. Faith is, is very similar. It's only faith that can take us to a place like Calvary. In i gyd yn canu geiriau dyfed yn aml fe, fel rhan nhw oedfa uh, gymun, ond i ni i gael fariau tro fy wyneb. On sit gallwn i deithio yno ond trwy ffydd, a gweld gras ac anfarwoldeb yn diferu dros dwy gyd. Ac yna mae ma delwedd Thomas William beth hesda'r fro yn, yn y gosach fyth, ac mae achos mae hwnnw'n dweud yn ddigon clir fenaid gwel i gethsemane, nid fy llygaid, ond, ond fy enaid, gweld gyda'r enaid. Isn't faith like sight too in, in regard to its large and expansive nature? One of the most wondrous things about sight is the fact that we can see from, from the top of Snowdon on a clear day, not, not only all the counties of Wales, but also some parts of Ireland, Scotland, England, and even the Isle of Man. My gan fydd a fath allu a ffwer hefyd. What a faculty faith is for grasping the past, the present and the future. The whole gamut of, of eternity itself. My golwg hefyd, mae'n my, rhyfeddol. O herwydd, mae'n rhoi elfen o sicrwydd i ni mewn bywyd. Seeing is believing. That's the familiar saying, isn't it? And I'm sure many of us have said, I couldn't believe what I heard until I saw it with my own eyes. Reminiscent, of course, of Thomas Didymus and his, his questioning nature after being told of, of the resurrection by the other disciples and he not believing. Os gwelw ni rhywbeth, Wel dyna fe, do, does dim cwestiynu'r peth wedyn. Ac mae gan ffydd yr un pwer i, I gadarnhau pethau i ni hefyd. Faith realises the thing and then it becomes, as we read it in another section of Hebrews, the assurance of things hoped for and the conviction of things not seen. Gweddiwn heddiw, Y bore yma, am fwy o ffydd er mwyn i ni brofi sicrwydd o bethau na ellir ei gweld. But just as faith is like sight, sometimes our faith, like our sight, is not always so clear. Our vision is blurred, blurred vision at times. Now, do we them and an the gun hen e govior hen wise hyarn a relba and reguir? And rather than had key and guithiona. 
And I remember my grandfather saying of his grandfather, and we must be going back now to the to the end of the of the 19th century, 1880s, 1890s. Only on a Sunday, he used to say, you were able to see Llanelli from Gowerton. Why only on a Sunday? Well, that was the only day, only full day, that the Elba steelworks in Gowerton and all the other blast furnaces around the Llanelli and the Gosheinen and the Lacher area were on stop, giving you a clear view of each place. Roedd y ddau le yno'r un fath drwy'r wythnos o'th reswm, ond hen fwg a ffwrnesu yn cuddio nhw'r golw gan eu cwato nhw wrth ei gilydd. Ydyn ni'n gallu gweld yn gliriach ar ddi sîl gwedwch. Can we see more clearly on a Sunday? Mae diw yno o hyd wrth reswm. Fel tre gwyr a llenelli, ond cofiwch, mae angen i ni glirio holl fwg a tharth y byd, ond llygaid weithiau, er mwyn i ni wel diw yn dos. Since natural sight is affected by all sorts of things, our faith is affected by, by things as well. It shouldn't be, but it is. Mae adegau wrth reswm, pan fo'n ffydd ni yn gadarn fel y graig, a ni'n sicr fod iesu yn eiddo i ni a ni'n ein blant iddo fe. Ac yna, adegau eraill, pan fo hen am heion ac angredyniaeth yn dod i'n un llethu a'n llorion i gyd o bryd i'w gilydd. Just as when we pass from, from darkness into light, you're, you're unable to bear the light at first. First, you're dazzled and need a short time to, to accustom your eyes to the brilliance of the light. But in time, it's, it's as if the eyes become strengthened and you can, you can bear more and more of the light until you can see again with comfort. Ond nid yw ffydd yn Iesu Grist yn rhywbeth tebyg, yn broses raddol o dyfu ac a'i ddyfedu yn y ffydd o weld mwy a mwy o ddydd i ddydd. And as we, now as a church, approach the communion table once more, what is there today in the whole world which is worth looking at through the eye of faith in comparison with Jesus. Os edrych wnaf i'r dwyrain draw, os edrych wnaf i'r, i'r de, ymhlith a fi'n ei yntau ddaw, does debyg iddo fe, ac iddo fe a bwrgo goniant nawr ac am byth. Amen.